It's odd, isn't it? As, as well as being the only woman on this panel, I am the only elected representative of the Scottish people. I'm surrounded by three peers who are not elected by the Scots. Now, this brings me on to another topic we need to look at. The Queen's you do speech, go on a bit, don't And you, that eh? is uh, reform <laughs> Come of, 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 reform, let reform of the House in. of Lords. Come on, let's well, let's hear, I'd let's love to hear, right. George, I'd love to hear what your party would like to do about reforming the House of Lords, because you were we, in power we, for 13 we, years, we, and despite promises, you did nothing. If you hadn't uh, made sure that a Tory government was elected, which you did, because we know Nicola wanted Cameron to come back, we'd have a Labour government oh, now. Oh, this is such we'd have tired a Labour old nonsense. We'd have a Labour government now uh, uh, legislating for a Senate of the nations and regions. We'd be supported by the Liberal Democrats. But Why the didn't you do that last time? You were in power for 13 years. Inter, inter, Why didn't you legislate for a Senate of the regions when you the were in power for the, 13 years? The interesting years? thing is we're, now, see, what, we're folks, now seeing this Tory-SNP coalition. We, we it's are building up. It's working well. It's working well.